Ah, oh, welcome back. We've had a few problems. Well, nothing new there. You'll have the problems yourself, no doubt, but you'll obviously make your own. We made ours, and there's a few more to share around with everybody. Problem we seem to have found, and we're pretty confident this time, is this manifold here is, is off a van. Now, Beatles do not have a servo, but vans do. And, or well, some vans do, anyway. And there's a big hole where this pipe fits. Well, obviously, it was sucking air like a wheezing horse going up a, a fell with a 10-ton load on its back. And it sucked all the air in and upset the carburetor settings. So we bunged it up with a quality technical size 10mm <laughs> bolt and a piece of hose of suitable size and length. And we're, we're going to give it another go and see what happens this time. Uh, I'm afraid there might not be so much flame to see, which makes it less exciting, of course, but uh, at the same time, we're just interested in a, a noisy, rattly, good old Beatle engine. So here goes then. <laughs> Wish me luck. <laughs> I've ripped me Good in. luck. <laughs> and oh, doesn't look too good there, does it? <laughs> Try again. Is that fuel in the petrol and stuff? Yeah, uh, yeah you get the fuel. Oh yeah, but in the canister. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Is it way down? Yeah. yeah. Let's have another go. Try and shut that choke off a little bit. Come on, Joe. Go on. Away you go. There's a room one, sitting back. That doesn't look like it. Oh. No. I think we had more chance to start. Well, this is this is honest. Yeah, I think we're going to have to have a look at the plugs here now. I'm going to right. pull, pull the plugs out and have a quick look, because it could be that the plugs have got wet feet. And as anybody knows, anybody with wet feet, you don't really want to play because you're pretty <laughs> miserable. So we'll uh, we'll take out the sparking plug and uh, have a quick look and see if it's all wet and horrible.